struggling times for Tottenham and manager Jerry Francis is a man under pressure. Defeat at Anfield would surely increase the clamour among Spurs fans for a change at the top. Robbie Fowler could hardly be relied on to sympathise. He was leading the Liverpool attack on his 200th appearance for the club. It was Spurs, though, who conjured up the first threatening moment of the game. Norwegian Stefan Iverson, only recently back from injury, nearly capitalising on a defensive mix-up, the pass applied by Chris Armstrong. But Tottenham's early promise faded in a miserable second half as Liverpool romped to an impressive win. This was the first goal, a tap-in for Steve McManaman, after Ian Walker could only palm out a shot from Jamie Redknapp. From there on, Spurs crumbled alarmingly, with a second goal arriving just two minutes later. Defenders reacted slowly as Robbie Fowler headed for goal, and although Walker saved superbly his effort, Ivan Leonardson followed up to score. Spurs were visibly sacking now and conceded a third on 65. Redknapp with a stunning drive after Stigbionaby and Fowler had created the opening for him. Just a case of how many now, and Liverpool obliged with a fourth late on to seal a comprehensive win. Walker left embarrassed by the challenge from substitute Michael Owen. In the end, the Spurs players were relieved the defeat wasn't heavier, as Jerry Francis was left to answer inevitable questions about his future. You've got your own personal pride. I'm going to sit down and uh, discuss the situation with um, Alan, and uh, we'll see how we go from there.